Hello everyone, this is Climatics, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get exalted with the Golden Lotus, Shadow Pan, and the August Celestials all in one day. I almost had the Claxi for you too, but as you see, I'm pretty close. I'm revered point nine, it looks like. On top of the achievements, you also get a chance to buy this beast right here for 3,000 gold at Exalted with the August Celestials. On top of that, Shadow Pan, the Golden Lotus, they both have plenty of other mounts to be purchased and on top of that what we're gonna do today is gonna net you thousands of gold in profit selling things on the auction house selling stuff that drops you'll see it's gonna be very profitable you're gonna get reputation you're gonna get mounts you're gonna get all kinds of stuff you're going to get reputation for your alternate tunes as well because I have so many of these stupid tokens that I have their account bound so I can send them on to my other tunes on either different realms or whatnot and get everybody to exalted in these no problem now so let me share with you what I do and why this works better than any other method now there, there is a method online there are plenty of videos that are telling you to go here to Gulai Halls and Ruins of Gulai and you farm all these mobs here and every so often these guys are going to drop a key. That key opens a chest inside the halls. Inside those chests you can get tokens. They give you 500, 1000 reputation for different factions. That's awesome. You want to do that. You spend four or five days, maybe a week doing that depending on your schedule. You'll get exalted eventually, but I'm talking about one day. You want to streamline this process? Let's go right to the source. Let's make sure we can get as many of these as possible. Now, while I'm thinking about it, let's start my video off with this guy right here. Let's get him, the Zandalari War Scout. This is one of the guys I'm going to be farming. It just so happened that it dropped right in front of me. These people parked on it, and I took it. Thank you very much. I will open this. I got the small bag of his Andalari supplies, and look at that. I got a stolen Claxi insignia. Grants 1,000 reputation from the Claxi. Okay. Now, let me explain to you what just happened. What just happened is in the beginning of my video explanation of what I was going to do, WoW decided to show you exactly what I'm doing. I'm using Cross Realm Assist, people. I'm sitting here farming the Zandalari War Scouts and the Warbringers. Now, in doing so, I'm getting these tokens right here. I'm getting this too. I open up this and look what's in here. I got Motes of Harmony. I got Exotic Leather, 19 of them. And I got Ghost Iron Ore, 18, a full stack a full stack now stolen Claxi insignia that's exactly what I need the stolen Claxi insignia I'm almost exalted so I have one for each one that you get all four of these drop from the Zandalari scouts and warbringers if you're using cross realm assist you're getting a ton of these per hour you will have so many of these in one hour two hours doing this that you will be exalted before you go to bed tonight if you do this. Now, I'm going to click on the Claxi because I need that one. Oh, I'm mounting. i got to get off my mount. So these guys are probably pretty pissed off at me because I just stole their uh, scout. They weren't paying attention. And that, boo-hoo, you know. So, this is what I do. We're going to start in the location number one. This first location is right here in um, Town Long Steeps. Make sure you have your NPC scan and NPC overlay ready for this. All right, it's going to be this purple square. They actually spawn right here and I'm going to sit here. Now, let me close this. Let me open up my cross realm assist. Manual join. I always move mine over to the side. And here we go. Join the first one and those people are going to disappear I'm on a different realm I wait five seconds I leave the group and I skip that one because of the question mark alright they let me in that goes away 
I wait five seconds. And I'm leaving the group. Now, Area 52 has four realms. And look at that right there. War Scout. Where is he at? There he is. Now, how much time between War Scouts, people? How much? What? A couple minutes? Boom. And now I got a stolen Klaxi insignia. That's really good. I need that. I might get exalted right here with that. No, nope. almost. Almost. So, as you can see, the turnover on these is exceptional. Now, you had all those people from that other server scouting this. Now, look at this server. It's empty. It is empty. Another tactic I was using was I would wait until I found a server that was really empty like this. And then I would fly to all five of the locations on this server since it's empty. Nobody's here. But it was just taking too long. So leave group next one and I stay in this spot and I just keep going and keep going and eventually the warbringers will spawn and I found this if a warbringer spawns just hang out for a second after you kill it the scouts come after the warbringers a lot directly after like maybe like a minute or two after if that 